What's up, people? It's your girl Adela. So, did you guys hear about what happened? Uh, 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 what, uh, let's not talk about the Numelaye, please. No man likes too much attention. Can we? Can we? Can we not talk about him? All right, call it or whatever. All right, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for my uncle, Senator Dino Malaye, who turned 45 on January 1st. Yeah! Kaido wants me to tell you, the man broke Nollywood's box office record by single-handedly producing some of the best movies of 2018. We started with Pirates of the Caribbean. Actually, that wasn't a movie. That was just his birthday celebration. The first movie was Dino by the Roadside. That was an action movie. He allegedly jumped out of the police vehicle in that movie. And then we had Dino and the broken neck <laughs> that was also good followed by dino and the kidnappers and then we had dino climb a tree coincidentally though all his movies were released on the days that he's summoned by the police or whenever he's supposed to appear in court for allegedly buying weapons for thugs which they used to shoot a policeman this is sergeant danjama saliu the wounded police officer who was shot on july 19th 2018 by assailants who police allege had acted on the instruction of Senator Dino Malaye at a checkpoint in Kogi State. I don't know whether he's guilty or not, but that is why they've been inviting him to come and give his statement. Anyway, the man has been wanted now by the police since July of last year. And now, ladies and gentlemen, without wasting time, the new movie of 2019 is out by Uncle Dino. It is called Dino and the Asthma Attack. Ha <laughs> ha! I'll tell you. Now, if you didn't watch it yet, it's really good. Police camped in front of Dino's house in Abuja for eight days. Police men have laid siege to the Abuja residence of the senator representing Kogi West and the National Assembly. Senator Dino Malai. Meanwhile, the man announced that he's not home. He said he's not even in Abuja. On the first day of the siege, Senator Dino Malai tells the media that he is not at the home under siege. I'm not in Abuja, but I will, I will definitely uh, show myself up when uh, I'm back, but I'm not in Abuja right now. <laughs> but he said he was seeing the policeman's activity via the security camera in front of his house. That account is brought into question. Police officials allege that Senator Malai is in the house currently occupied by police and has been seen shouting at officers from the windows on the uppermost floor of the besieged compound. Now, after some days, policemen cut off his electricity and his water supply. By this time in the movie, I was so mad. You know, I'm Dino's girl, you know? I'm like, why were they trying to arrest my uncle by fire by force? I was fighting for this man. The man said he's not home because why did they come outside his house? And then another actor came into the movie. That was his brother. He cried for help on national TV. Keep in mind, this was the same brother that was with him when he was allegedly kidnapped by four gunmen. The only witness at the scene. What is the situation of things with your brother now? Where is he? Is he at home or is he somewhere else? Because of the injustice on a daily basis, we cannot trust or believe anything they say or they do. I believe they are out to arm my brother. If not, what is his desperation? Our policemen and security men have been taken away since, since over, over seven, eight months ago. Kai, my brother, I feel for you. I feel for this man. What, where, what is the whereabouts? Can you tell us the whereabouts of your brother? Where is he now? Mr. Sheung, I cannot confirm categorically because they have not allowed anybody into that compound. Wow, wow. so um, you could not reach Dino. Did, did you call his phone? Because for some reason he was able to use his phone during this time to tweet and to record videos and to upload videos for those of us that care about him. Happy New Year, fellow countrymen and women. I wish you a very prosperous New Year ahead. Let the God who answers by fire be God indeed. Yes. Mm. Tell them, Uncle Dino, preach. Do for us and for me, Dino Melai, what you did in the land of Egypt and prove that you are God. Mm, 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 mm. Do I ask for peace between you and my enemies? If I do, they will think I'm scared. Do I ask for prosperity between in the camp of my enemies? If I do, they will think I am afraid. I knew it. Uncle Dino is not afraid of anything. Body. Well, that was what I thought in the movie until the movie took a twist. Hey, I'm 
Can you guys believe that Dino came out of his house to surrender to the police? I was like, no, 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 no. I could not believe it. Uncle Dino lied that he wasn't home half back. Eberolo Uncle Dino. So that was how they drove my uncle to the police station and then it got real. Please hold it, hold it, I beg Maybe by the time the, the robber see the season now, 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 this time. Ha, ha! What kind of wala is this? Who is it? Who is it? Mark one first. Yes, sir. Take, 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 take. Aha, I made the word sound. So, you know, yeah, this one. Sorry, was that real? <laughs> that, that cannot be real. Anyway, so Uncle Dino suddenly had a asthma attack <laughs> and then he fainted. I'm telling you, he writes the best movies. So instead of Nigerians to pity Uncle Dino, they were making fun of him, even children. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> but it wasn't just the children that were making fun of my uncle. Can you guys believe that? Regular Nigerians, come on, Nigerians, they were making fun of the man. Say, that offense, say, you're the fence, you're the fence. You go wake up, say, I didn't lie, you go G. Now, you and me and you know, say, eh, you know, go free, you know, free escape prison. You go bab your head, that your Ferrari, you go buy Ferrari, you buy two red Ferrari. Say, we know your story. Only you get two Rose West, only you, you get Lamborghini, you go here, yeah, van. Nigerians, a better along. Anyway, so the police gave the no the best care. Eh? In fact, they brought in specialists to come and look at him. We took him to a specialist center where he was reviewed by three specialists. So, by and large, he's in sound health. But Dino wasn't happy. He wanted to be flown abroad. You know what? Your BP is high. Oh, what am I saying? Thank you for joining me. There's God. So despite the fact that he was well, he refused to go for trial. He said that his BP was high. He said his BP is high and um, he's feeling dizzy. You, you don't mean it. So how long do you think this thing can stay? I don't know. <laughs> you know Hey, Ikorodu boys, what is wrong with you guys? Making fun of your old senator. So the police decided to move Dino to the DSS hospital. But then when he got there, he refused to enter. He said that no one told him that they were taking him there. So so he laid outside. <laughs> now, <laughs> now, when I saw that picture, you know, I felt so bad. I felt really, really bad. Like for the jokes, I felt bad. Not for the senator, but for the bottle of granite, the epa that was in the picture. I said, ah. You guys don't understand. For those of us that don't live in Nigeria, do you know how much we pay to get original Nigerian granuts? I need one minute. Oof. Oof. Ah. But you know, jokes aside, if a Nigerian lawmaker is behaving like this, we're in serious trouble. For real. Please, people of Kogi West, I'm, I'm begging you. Can you please make a better decision in the coming election? Or tell your son to go to Nollywood and audition. He has actually auditioned. I'm very sure they will give him a role anytime, any day he shows up. Because trust me, we are tired of his drama. Eh? Now, can I talk about what I wanted to talk about?